Good evening, crafty friends. This is Gail. Crafty Mim. Um, I'm... Oh, my TV just came on. Oops. Let me turn that down. So, uh, stay. So, I haven't done a whole lot of hauls. I'm trying to save money. And I'm find out when I'm going through my stuff here in my room, I am finding stuff that, as I said before, I really don't need to be in a craft store. I have enough stuff here to craft with. <laughs> and I can, and also I like to make my own ephemera. I have enough stamps to do some of my ephemera, the stamp ephemera. I got enough stickers. I got enough um, dyes. I have no reason to be in a craft store. So, anywho, so I have been working on this book. This is from my vacation that we had with my five grandchildren. My daughter and I took down to the ocean, uh, to the beach last summer, and I have been poking away at it. I did several pages last night. Um, I had a good weekend with my granddaughters here. Um, my one granddaughter turned eight yesterday. So I had them for a good part of the day yesterday. So, and all day Friday. So we had a good, good weekend. And then tonight we went to the RV show. My husband and I love camping. Um, and he has a motorcycle. So now he's just trying to decide what kind of camper fifth wheel we want to get. Because our camper now that we have is 12 years old. We just want something new. So, whatever. We're not getting any younger. We deserve it. We work hard. We play hard. <laughs> Anyhow, so this is the tassel that I have made to put on this bookend. It's got a turtle and it's got a starfish. It's got a tassel and some beads. It's got some flowers, some burlap flowers that I don't even remember where I got them from. Most of this book is consisted of Authentique, Bo Bunny, and um, Graphic 45. But there's other things thrown in there as well. Um, ribbons and laces that I have sprayed with my spray inks. And that I have put in here. I did a lot of sewing. And it's not even close to being done. I still have tons and tons of pictures to put in here and you can see how chunky it is. <laughs> I'm not even done yet. So anyhow and it's not even bound yet. I just wanted to show what I've been working on um, just to check in with you guys on YouTube. So I'm just going to do a quick flip, flip, flip through. This is on our way down to the beach right here. Three of the boys were in my car with me and they kind of like conked out. They're not used to being on trips and stuff like that. They sit on their... It's so sad. They sit on PlayStation on their days off at, on during summer. I coax them and coax them to go outside and they don't want to have nothing to do with it. So, we wore them out this trip. But they want to come back. So, if we're going back for seven days, six days next year. So, yeah. This is just showing the place that we stayed it's not the best place, but you know what? It had a pool and it was a block away from the beach. We didn't have to drive anywhere. It had an efficiency where we could cook. I found this, I think, offline, and I printed it and, and inked it. I made a little pocket here with a little ephemera that I stuck in there. <clears throat> so it's not the best looking place. It's very nostalgic, should I say. And you know, with five kids, you don't want to have something nice. <laughs> with them jumping around like a bunch of animals. No. Little, little um, tags I made. The ephemera from um, Graphic 45. This is from Graphic 45. Um, I don't even know where I got this at. This is Graphic 45. Made a little tuck spot here. I thought this was cool with these guys holding hands and these two holding hands. I made this with a little stamp and some 
he dyed paper. And he was so protective. It was so cute. So protective of her in the water. It's just adorable. So that I miss scrapbooking. But the scrapbooks just take up too much space. This doesn't take up that much space. And I can still get my pictures together as I like. This is my daughter. She's being so silly. She actually, there was a pack of, of uh, gummy bears. And they're all stuck together. And she just took a bite out of it. <laughs> this one was sacked out. We got down there that day. And as I said, they're not used to being off their... Their uh, PlayStation, as you said. See, he fell asleep with headphones on and his tab. He went. We went to the beach that day. You know, plus driving a couple hours. Went to the beach. Went to the pool, and he was wiped. Had dinner, out like a light. I stamped this image, and then I put it on a piece of tea dye paper. I got this offline. You can find so much ephemera offline, you'd be amazed. And we went and played golf one night. We had them all there. They all had a blast. It was just so fun and so cool to have. I have nine grandkids, you know, and seven of them live up here in Maryland. The other two live in Alabama. I put that between the pages because they're getting, they stick to each other. I don't have page protector, so I just throw this in between to keep them sticking. It says, play, love. I mean, play, life, and brave, because she's so brave because of the hands there. He just wants to whack the crap out of it. <laughs> so cute. And he just doesn't know what he wants to do. Tore some paper, inked it, and laid it down. I rough up some of the edges there and make it look rough. Got this offline. Um, that's graphic 45 that I put in there. And then uh, Bow Bunny did sewing. This is actually two pages that I put together because they were plain. And, you know, I need something other than plain. So I try to do stuff with it to make it look like it's got something to somewhat of a background. Um, I took that and inked that and roughed it up. And then that's basically all the pictures except for a couple in the back. So I'm just going to flip through real quick. There's a tuck spot and this says a door. Um, these are plain pages I haven't done anything with. I sewed some of this copper ribbing, ribbon on here. <coughs> And then here, I just kept on going. So some of this down. This is just glued on the edge. But some of this ribbon down. And this is a napkin I decoupaged because it was a plain white page. And I thought it look, would look cool. This one opens up for my pull scenes. So, I have a lot of pictures of the kids in the pool. I made this little baggie. It's a actual uh, a tuck spot. There's a tuck spot right here. Um, yeah, I'm just having fun working on this. I can't wait to get it done. Some more laces that I colored. Just sticking stuff down. And then it's so cool because from the dye or that's on these ribbons or this lace is leaving just marks on the pages that I think it looks cool. Um, this is them all on the beach. I think it's so I can't wait till this summer and do it again. This I took uh, sequences and glitter put them glued them all down and I took um, uh, glossy accents over top of it to hold them down to seal it this is a tuck spot I made I used the Tim Holtz um, 
oxide dyes, stamp dyes, and then tuck spot there for pocket. Some of these are really plain. Here's another one I made. This says a joy. Another pocket that I made the uh, tag with. This one says dream. You can only dream when you're a mermaid. I made this as a plain paper and I stamped it and used my my um, inks and just inked it up. Yeah, I mean, I'm having fun. This is a couple different pages put together to make it look the ocean and the beach. And then I made another um, fold out. And these are all plain. This one says play. This has a tuck spot right there. And that comes to the end of the book. So, well, thank you for watching. I will get this chunky monkey done sooner. I hope then later. Um, you have a good Sunday. Um, enjoy this rainy, wet weather here if you're on the East Coast. Um, yeah, I am going to go watch my Dead Live in a half hour. My Walking Dead. My favorite show on the weekends. So, well, thank you. Um, comment, su subscribe, give me a thumbs up. Um, and watch again. I don't know. I'm going to videotape one next, but whoever knows. So have a good night. Thank you.